And what are you wearing today? That's from Topshop. These are from Topshop. And these Great. are from Urban Outfitters. Um, the jacket's from Topshop. These are cheap Monday and it's a convict. <laughs> <laughs> also, do you know that Topshop uses a sweatshop to make their clothes? And what do you think about that? <laughs> um, I don't know. I didn't know that. Actually. Would you be willing to pay more for your clothes if you knew about that? They're working for about three people an hour per day. Really pay like, yeah, I mean, all other shops doing the same. The problem is that yeah. you don't know these things and you're not on the high street. Who's doing what? I mean, if it was more open and you yeah. knew more about it, then. But before I go into any shop, I don't want to have to go on a website and research what I'm about to buy. It's, you know, it's time consuming. I don't have time in my day to look at every shop I'm going to go into. And what about the shirt? Gap. <laughs> oh, Gap. And what about the jumper? Yeah. John Lewis. Honestly, the best jumpers, John Lewis. That's oh, did you know that Gap uses an ethical training? So their clothes are made in sweatshops? What do you think about that? Uh, I don't know, I'm always a bit dubious of these things. Why? Uh, it's like the thing with like fair trade, how actually fair trade they try and help people, but it really kind of messes up a lot of people. Uh, <laughs> they're gonna, they're gonna squirm. Would you believe to pay more if it was being made in an ethical way? Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't really think about ethics though with clothes. Oh, you're thinking about food. I don't know. I've never really had some raise that issue okay. as much. I thought it was all like, let's say Baker or Gap. I always think I'm like Nike or, but they, I just kind of picture them having these factories of these little children. Yeah. Who can't afford to go to school. Yeah, they, yeah. So, so, so those are sort of brands. Or running I've water. Yeah. yeah. Now, Good. now I think about it. So it's not something I really think about. Um, not like consciously don't think about. But yeah, I just but had, the, had, no one raises had, the issues. So they never yeah, think about yeah, it. Yeah, exactly. That. Mm. This is from Primark because okay. it kind of looked like super dry, so cheap and cheerful. That is true. Uh, these are from Top Man, the skinny vintage ones. I'm coming to get new clothes, so <laughs> this, is, this is all old stuff. So what is it though? What are the this brands? Is my comfortable jumper, American Apparel. Okay. Top Man jeans. Top Man jeans, okay. That's it. So what do you think Pretty if I plain. told you that um, um, Topshop use yeah. sweatshops for their clothing? I know, it is really bad. I do feel bad sometimes. It's not really fair. It's like with the prime, that whole Primark thing as well. Yeah. Like, I do feel guilty. <laughs> but what are you going to do about it? I don't know. Because like, I don't, sometimes you just feel like you don't know what you can do. It seems that you're very aware about what you're I wearing. Know, I, I am. So why do you still buy them if you know where they're because coming then, from? Because then I think it's because of like fashion, so like the pressure of like labels, if you know what I mean. Yeah. So I suppose you don't know where else you would go. So you don't really care. <laughs> no, well, yeah, I do get it, but it doesn't really push me properly. Right. No, it's not to do with fashion, it's just unique clothes, isn't it? That's, if that's how clothes are made, yeah. there's not a lot you can do about it.